The jury heard from two witnesses today, both called by the prosecution, who said Ann Mitchell was right to report Dr. Arafeliz, implying that Sheriff Roberts was wrong. But the defense called a former Texas Ranger to the stand, who calls Roberts an honest man. Former Winkler County Hospital Administrator Stan Wiley is having a change of heart, at least according to his testimony today. Wiley says that while he did fire Ann Mitchell and Vicki Lynn Galley, he now believes they were correct in reporting Dr. Rolando Arafeliz to the Texas Medical Board. Wiley also said he never thought it was a good idea for Arafeliz to complain of harassment to the sheriff. Next on the stand, Dr. Ko Pham said medical practices done by Dr. Arafeliz had him concerned and that they certainly warranted review by the TMB. Pham mentioned the now infamous rubber tip that was sutured to a patient's finger and the botched skin graft as major concerns, among others. The third and final witness was called by the defense. Before retiring in 2009, Jess Malone spent 15 years as a Texas Ranger and has known Sheriff Roberts since 1995. Malone testified that Roberts is an honest man. He also told the jury that he read the sheriff's report when Roberts was investigating the nurses in 2009. The former ranger said he was drinking coffee with Roberts and Scott Tidwell at the sheriff's office when he glanced over the report and didn't see anything wrong. That statement prompted the prosecution to spend the next few hours grilling Malone. He later admitted that the sheriff's investigation could have been done better and said that some of it, according to law enforcement standards, was conducted improperly. The judge informed the jury that at the current rate, this trial will go until Tuesday, if not Wednesday, or even longer. The Texas Medical Board officials are likely to be the first witnesses called tomorrow. Reporting in the newsroom, Bo Berman, CBS 7 News.